Hey Stampers, welcome to another Watch It Weekly Wednesday. I'm Aubrey Paxton, a part of the Stampin' Jill creative team, and today I'm excited to share with you a new stamp set and dies from the holiday catalog. So this is the stamp set, it's called the Cup of Christmas, and the dies are the Cup of Cheer dies, and they come, there's 13 dies in there, let me pull in this little sheet here you get a better look at what they look like so cute there's the little mugs and these cute little overlays you can put over them the candy cane which if you turn over it could be like a cute straw in the cup or these cute tags just so much little fun elements in there and it's been a really fun one to play with when we first played with it obviously our mind first goes to Christmas because of the sayings in the set Cup of sending you a cup of cheer, sweet Christmas wishes, comfort and joy, Merry Christmas. It's it's a Christmas set and we've played with it and come up with super cute Christmas cards. You can see in there there's a little straw, that's the candy cane, but put it upside down and you can get a straw. And cute cups all stacked. Ooh, and glitter. Who doesn't love a little Christmas glitter? So cute. So, Christmas. That's what you think of when you think when you see this set originally. But I always like to take a stamp set and think, how can I make that stamp go all year long? Because these cups are so cute and they need to not only be around at Christmas time. So I wanted to show you a couple of fun things that I've done to come up with some non-Christmas cards that go with this set. So first I wanted to show you a little bit about this set. Um, Stampin' Up! did something really fun when they created this set stamp set. If you open it up, you can see there are places. This is a photopolymer set and they have printed on the on this back sheet. They've printed all of the stamps and where you can put them in there. Do you see that? Such an awesome idea so you know if you're missing a stamp or where they all go and keep them nice and organized. I hope that they continue to do this for new sets in the future because I think it's a great idea. One of the really cool features of the the mugs in this set is that they are double sided. So I wanted to show you that in my stamping. I grab my I'm using um, a note card sized paper so it's five by three and a half a five by seven piece of paper here. So I'm gonna stamp down these mugs. So I'm going to start with terracotta tile and I'm going to use my cute polka dot stamp here and I'm just gonna just stamp it and to some of you you're thinking oh my gosh she's gonna get it straight she not we're just eyeballing it because that's so much fun so there you go now I'm gonna clean this one just bring my chamois in Okay, and then I'm gonna bring in my stamp, my striped mug, and I'm gonna use Pretty Peacock, and I'm gonna stamp down my striped mug, just like that. Okay, now you can notice my mugs on my blocks are facing two different ways. Now, I am going to completely switch them. This is the coolest part of this set. So let me clean this really quick. You can take the mug, the striped mug, flip it completely over, and use the other side. So you get a mug both ways. Is that not so cool that Stampin' Up! made a double-sided stamp? Oh, it's so fun. So you can do it with both the polka dot and that striped mug. So I'm just going to flip them over and do the same thing. So I'm going to do terracotta tile with my polka dot down here and I you guys I'm just eyeballing this it is not perfect but that's kind of the draw of this background on here is it's just like kind of a fun funky looking background okay and then I'm going to take my striped one in the Rococo Rose and stamp that next to it so I have just different cups going different ways okay and then I'm going to clean them and then I'm going to do that again. I'm going to flip them over again and I'm going to stamp them again. I'm going to do the polka dot one in peacock. A little bit of 
there. Like that. And then the striped one in Rococo Rose. Like that. So it's just like a cute background of mugs on there. It's so fun. So let me, I'll show you the finished card here. You can see the cute background back there. And then I just did Here's to Strong Women from the, Strong, the Here's to Strong Women stamp set um, that's new in the annual catalog. And then just embellished a little teacup and put it on there. And I thought that was so cute. So much fun. And then let me show you one other card that I came up with using this. I used the Modern Heart stamp set that's in the annual catalog as well. And I stamped You're My Person and this cute background um, piece that's in that set and then I um, did a fun fold there did another cute card with cute I love the coloring in this card so much fun and that metallic ink is one of my new favorites so this stamp set is so much fun I love it for Christmas it has so many cute Christmas sayings in it but I wanted to show you that it's not just a one holiday wonder you can do it all year long you just have to add a few different sayings or whatever you want there but I'd love to see what you can come up with using this stamp set, um, whether it's Christmas or whether it's another all occasion card, I'd love to see it. Make sure you post pictures down in the comments below. Um, if you have any questions or would like to place an order, you're welcome to visit our website at stampandjill.com. Thanks so much for visiting and we'll see you next time for another Watch It Weekly Wednesday.